Find a quiet and comfortable place to sit. You can pause this meditation until you're ready. Once you're ready, close your eyes, take a deep breath, and let your mind settle. We will be focusing on scriptures that guide us and being mindful of our tongues and avoiding disputes. As you listen to these words, allow them to gently guide your thoughts and actions. Begin by listening to the following verses from the New International Version of the Bible. Let each verse resonate with you, inviting you to reflect on its meaning in your life. Proverbs 15.1 A gentle answer turns away wrath, but a harsh word stirs up anger. Imagine yourself in a moment of conflict. Visualize responding with a gentle, calm answer. Notice if the atmosphere changes. If tension eases, let this image settle in your heart, understanding the power of gentleness and turn away wrath. James 1, 19 through 20. My dear brothers and sisters, take note of this. Everyone should be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry because human anger does not produce the righteousness that God desires. For this verse, picture yourself in a conversation where you are tempted to react quickly. Instead, see yourself pausing, listening intently, and choosing your words thoughtfully. Feel the peace that comes from being slow to speak and slow to anger. Embrace the righteousness that God desires in you. Ephesians 4.29 Do not let any unwholesome talk come out of your mouths, but only what is helpful for building others up according to their needs, that it may benefit those who listen. For this verse, recall any recent interaction. Consider moments where your words could have been more uplifting. Imagine speaking words that build others up. What does that sound like? What does that feel like? That are helpful and kind. Feel that positive impact of your words on those who listen. Proverbs 21, 23. Those who guard their mouths and their tongues keep themselves from calamity. Visualize yourself in a day, consciously guarding your mouth and your tongue. See a protective barrier filtering out harmful words. Experience the calm and safety that comes from this practice. No one is keeping you from calamity. Matthews 5, 9. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. Reflect on what it means to be a peacemaker. Envision yourself actively creating harmony in your relationships. Feel the blessing and honor of being called a child of God, committed to peace in every situation. Now let's engage deeply with these scriptures by repeating the following affirmations after me. We will say each affirmation three times, allowing the words to sink into our hearts and minds. Proverbs 15, one, repeat after me. A gentle answer turns away wrath. A gentle answer turns away wrath. A gentle answer turns away wrath.
Let's move on to James 1, 19 through 20. Repeat after me. I will be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. I will be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. I will be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. Ephesians 4.29, repeat after me. I will speak words that build others up. I will speak words that build others up. I will speak words that build others up. Proverbs 21.23, repeat after me. I will guard my mouth and tongue to keep myself from calamity. I will guard my mouth and tongue to keep myself from calamity. I will guard my mouth and tongue to keep myself from calamity. Matthews 5 and 9 repeat after me. Blessed are the peacemakers, I will seek peace. Blessed are the peacemakers, I will seek peace. Blessed are the peacemakers, I will seek peace. Let's take these affirmations and connect them with practical actions through our week. This week, when you find yourself in a conflict, practice giving a gentle answer. Make a conscious effort to listen more in your conversation. Notice how being slow to speak and slow to anger affects the interaction. In your daily conversations, focus on speaking words that are helpful and uplifting. Pay attention to the impact it has on others. Throughout the day, be mindful of your speech, guard your words, and prevent harm and promote peace. Look for opportunities to be a peacemaker in your relationships. Seek ways to create harmony and reflect on God's love. As you bring your meditation to a close, take a moment to reflect on the wisdom of God's word and how it can guide your daily life. When you are ready, offer your own prayer, asking for the strength and guidance to practice mindful speech and to seek peace in all of your interactions. Breathe.